Hello and welcome to my first devlog video. I'm currently creating a top-down arena-based shooter that's pretty basic and has traps, waves, environmental hazards and roguelite elements. I'm planning on having a few different arenas with different mechanics. As you can see, this one has poor visibility and some traps. So, yeah. Uh, as you can see, every time you finish a wave, you can choose yourself a power up, and the new enemies start every two waves. I'm planning on doing it. For example, this is a mad cow that just rushes into you. <laughs> and you have dashes. I don't think I mentioned that. But yeah, I'm planning on having dash upgrades also. Something like a blink or leaving behind magma or things like that. For now, I only have five types of enemies and two bosses with a few basic upgrades for this archer. And yeah, I do have a class system in place, but I only have an archer for now. And here we can see, where are you, oh here it is, the projectile slime, kind of a timid slime that spits out you and runs away when you get close. I think it's a bit cute, and it got pushed away, interesting. Hello, well, this is the first boss that I created, it's a bit of a mad cow, it just, for the first phase he just rushes into you, then he goes to the second phase and starts spamming you with his bow. For the third phase it's kinda combination of the bow, as you will see in a bit. I think I made him a bit too tanky. No, or not. Eh, as you can see. He jumps at you. It shoots at you. And then he jumps again and rinse and repeat. Nothing special, pretty basic. But I messed up here. I think there's some bug with collision on this boss. Which is pretty embarrassing, but I'll fix it later. And this is another mob that I created, it's kinda stationary, it has a pretty large attack range. It just spams fireballs at you, nothing special. It will not move into you, it will not run away from you like the timid slime, it will just peep you from afar. Then this is another one of the mobs, it's also huge range, it does the magic circle appears below you and then fire, <laughs> that's such a bad description, but yeah, it is like that.
and this is the last boss that I created the second one for now it just spams fireballs like the mob that you saw on the which way was it sixth this boss is literally just a combination of those two enemies and now the magic circles and fire starts and it will not stop at all until you die and it leaves behind a trail of fire which i think is interesting and the third wave is i mean phase is the combination of both hope you enjoyed bye